Hi girls and guys, it's Mr. Tracky and we'll run the right track. Today I'm going to talk about changes that are coming to the Slurp Juice and the new P90 Compact SMG coming to Fortnite Battle Royale in most likely the 5.1 version update. Now the Slurp Juice was first introduced to Fortnite in version 1.8 which is quite a while ago now and it was the first item that would actually heal your shield and your health at the same time for a maximum percentage of 25 health points or shield points and this would be done over a gradual period of time and it, the good thing about it is it only took two seconds to consume and it would increase everything by one second to the maximum of the 25 for either shield or health. Slurp juice is of epic rarity and it's something that you don't come across often but it doesn't come without its drawbacks. I mean you can only take one slurp juice at a time and then you can't take another one for 25 seconds carrying the maximum of two. Now the issue that you have with these particular things in question is why pick up a slurp juice and wait the 25 seconds when you'd probably be better off picking up minis or whatever and it's it's something that people tended to do and you don't actually come across them that often anyway so it has been suggested for a long time by several different people how they could improve the slurp juice and a reddit user going by the name of half health is the most recent person to suggest something for the slurp juice and it looks like it's caught the epic developers attention here on the screen is the details of what was suggested if you have 100 shield all the slurp juice goes towards healing if you have 100 health points all the slurp goes towards shield example before slurp 80 health points zero shield after slurps 100 health points and 30 shields this was the suggestion made on reddit and it looks like as you can see epic eric is the person who has looked at it and thought actually this is a pretty good idea so it looks like not only will the slurp juice prioritize how first but it also seems like they're going to increase it to an overall 75 points instead of the original 50 and it will heal at two health points per second instead of the original one second so that's pretty good addition to the game and a well needed buff for epic rarity item in fortnite battle royale guys tell me what you think about this bump i i feel like it's it's a well needed thing for the slurp i do like my slurps they're great for taking in the first few storms if you get caught in them because it will counter the storm but this just makes perfect sense because there are only certain circumstances that i take slurps and any of my teammates will take slurps we usually take mid kits or we'll take uh, bandages or shield over these most of the time or we'll use one if we see another we won't even bother with it again the next thing on our agenda is the new compact smg more than likely this will come in at the same time as the new slurp probably sometime this week if we're lucky i'm i'm, I'm predicting it's going to be this week in my personal opinion and this gun looks very similar to the real life personal defense weapon which is the p90 submachine gun it comes with a clip size of around 50 the p90 so i'm assuming that's going to be in the same as this this gun is already available in fortnite but only in the save the world variant of the game and it seems like it's very popular because it's been suggested by so many people to come into the core gameplay for the battle royale mode it will be available in epic and legendary variants so it's going to be quite a rare weapon and it'll be from my memory the first epic and legendary uh, smg we've had apart from the tactical submachine gun that we had previously so it'd be nice to see a gold smg in the game however i know a lot of people hold reservations because they have the feeling that the game is getting very smg heavy which i do understand it seems as if epic games wants to give us an alternative to shotguns and they are doing their absolute best to make sure shotguns aren't the go-to weapon in close up uh, battles now 
the Tommy gun mounts at the moment and the new SMG is quite powerful so I can only imagine this will have a massive drop off in terms of damage you won't be able to hold people down from distance with this but you'll definitely in the right range very close it will be absolutely lethal uh, that that's my prediction for this because they definitely want a alternative to shotguns in the game guys let me know down in the comment section whether you believe the game is getting a bit smg heavy do you think that they're trying too hard to uh, eliminate shotgun use i i think it's a healthy balance to have shotguns in the game and smgs the, the two giving you the option instead of having to have to go for that shotgun is great it's going to definitely have a massive capacity in terms of magazines but i'm hoping you can't spray people down from across the map guys there are many buttons you could hit but the like and subscribe button i hope they took your fancy and as always guys don't forget to stay on the right track peace